Hello everyone and welcome back to Control. In the last session we unlocked a new floor which we have descended down into. We found a new power from the X-ray light box which took us a moment to figure out how to reach little puzzle there but uh, I sort of lucked my way into that, that was good. And uh, it's, it's given us the ability to take control of people when they're on low health. Uh, but you do have to be pretty close to them to use it, and it doesn't last forever. But when it does end, they die rather than reverting back to the enemy. So that's pretty good. Going to see if we can make some use of that today, because I didn't actually get a chance to in the last bit, aside from obviously in the astral plane section where you acquire it. And uh, we are now on our way to chat with a new character who heads up one of the main teams in the Bureau, Marshall. So let's go see her, shall we? Down here, I believe. Oops. I always press B to get out of the map and just completely dash off to the side. Hello, is that... No, I thought this was notes we could read. Alright, let's have ourselves a chit-chat. Marshall, can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you. Who is this? My name is Jesse Faden. I'm coming to help. Faden? Hold on. I'm sending the elevator for you. We need a talk. You got that right. Sweet. Take the elevator to reach More Marshall. Oh, shit. Really? Where? Hi. Lol. Okay, if you want to kill yourselves, that's fine by me. Oof. Thank you. I'll be taking all of this. Right, the elevator's there. Should we just have a quick... Look around, or wait, is this where we came in from originally? Yeah, okay, we've looped around. This was blocked off before, I remember. Okay, cool, cool. Down we go. Do 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 Reflection off the lift door. That's kind of cool. <laughs> ah, that's also cool. It's a multi, a multi-door lift. To the party now. Marshall is right down the hall. Hi. Well, this is fancy. Do you have any intel for me? Of course you don't. What about your neighbours? Oh! It's a good day. Rubber duck supplement. Discovered in the home of Agent Something after his young daughter complained of being followed by her rubber duck. According to Agent Something, the matter was ignored, believed to be the result of a child's imagination, until he began to hear the quacking at night. After discovering the item hiding in his daughter's closet, he brought it to the Bureau for study. Update. It was discovered that Agent Something was bringing known paranatural materials into his home, illegally taking them outside the oldest house. How this may have affected the creation of an altered item is being investigated. Agent Something has been terminated. Good banter. Don't be doing that, mate. How can you not expect that to lead to just the worst times for you? Eager to speak to you yeah, I bet she is. Oof, that was a real hard moving target to hit there. No judgement, please. Can I shoot these guys? Just go straight through them, fair enough. Worth a check. Worth a little checkeroo. Gimme, gimme, sweet, sweet checkpoint. No kissing the ground this time. Awesome, awesome. Hmm. 
Have we been in this section? Yeah, that was yeah, that was where we came from. That's the main lift down there. And we fought our way around there. Cool. Cool. It's nice that you can see where you've been and everything. Luck and probability. Research. Have a look for those collector bubbles. Eh? <laughs> there you are. I was starting to worry. Here I am, indeed. But, uh, hang about. Just got a little bit of scouting to do. Hmm. <laughs> Does anything actually happen with you? Is there a reason you're here? No? Give you one more cycle? No? Hmm. Okay. Wonder what they're using that to research then. Oh, and this. Anything? Hmm. Down is down. Up is also down. Bureau alert failed. Oh no. What a tragedy. Tragedy. Wait, I don't have level 5 clearance, do I? Why is this not red? Oh, okay. Yeah, no, I don't. Right, Marshall, sup. How's tricks? Congratulations on your appointment, Director Faden. Thank you. I'm Helen Marshall, head of Bureau Operations. Zachariah's dead then, and I assume you found his gun. Just call me Jesse. Trench told me to find you. He said you could help. And he told you this through the hotline. It makes sense. None of this phases her? Really? Here's the situation. Darling created the HRAs in a lab nearby. We need more if we're gonna survive this attack. My rangers can't secure the lab alone, not against those things. We need more firepower. At least she seems to know. So what you're saying is your here. rangers are shit at their jobs. She could know about Dylan. I can clear out the hiss. I'll be your firepower. That's a good answer. Is she testing me? Darling has systems in place to protect his labs. This should help you get past them. We'll talk more. Are you giving me level 5 clearance? Rangers, let her through. We'll have to lock the door behind you. Find Sorry, Darling's HRA lab. Oh no, she didn't give me level 5 clearance. You bitch. Here I was thinking you were going to help me out. Alright, straight into it, are we? Wait, are those like regular civilians or? I see rangers over there. We have to help them. Oh. Ow. My God, that dude heals himself. Okay. My health is low as shit. Oh shit. That'll do. Lads, I'm sure you can uh, sort yourselves out. I'm just going to have a look around in here, okay? BRB. Don't don't die. Try not to die. Just having a quick look see. There's there's absolutely nothing in here. Never mind. There yeah, there is. Worth it. Zoom. Okay, who wants some? You want some? I'll give it you. The ritual division. Wait, where did the where did the thingy go? Is that what's healing them? Is that why the I think it must be. There it is. That was why they had the health thing over them. It was recharging him a lot as well. Like that was nothing to laugh at.
you. Go and get him. Go and get that prick. Do it. Attack. 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 Wait, really? Are you just going to stand there? Okay. Get him. Get him. Kill. Shoot. Injure. Maim. Fuck's sake. I'll do it myself then, shall I? Hi there. Lovely to meet ya. Okay. Okay. <laughs> what is that? A yellow one? Seize accelerator. That's got to be another tier up. I still hear creature noises. Are we not done here yet? I don't see anyone else. But the red light is very much still here. Hmm. Let's have a look at what we got then. What did I put on this? Just more damage, I think. Oh, god damn it. It's doing the thing where you can't move around again. Uh, seize speed plus 70%. Oh, that's a level 4? Fuck level 3. We've jumped... We've got loads of 1s, a couple of 2s, and then straight all the way. All the way. It's level 4. Plus 70% sea, sea speed. That is hard to pass up. I'm about to get... Oh no, I'm not about to get... I do now have my second personal mod slot. Well then, no contest. Let's give it a shot. Huh. <laughs> Give it a shot. Uh, shatter stuff. Eh. Not so interesting. Uh, kill his charge. We've completed. Rangers in the research sector. We need to continue doing. Investigate the training course. Did we ever figure out where that was? I mark it on the map. It's not here, is it? No. And you can't. It doesn't look like you can. You can't change map layers. The only way to change the map you're looking at is to go down to that floor. So uh, not much point in having that selected at the moment. Maybe I. W Do you reckon I was supposed to find it back when we got this mission? Because I really thought like it was something for later. But now that we've kind of moved on, I'm kind of thinking that I done goofed and that I was supposed to do it then and there not sure well we can go back we can go back if necessary which it seems like it will be hmm. I hear monsters I just don't see monsters also don't see a way out of this place. Oh. <laughs> Brilliant. Oh wait, is there a is there a control point I need to cleanse now? Oh, right here. I'm blind. Very blind. Uh oh. Chief Lewis. Hello, Chief. Easy, mate. Chief Lewis ain't got nothing on this bitch right here. The director is the best at his warped. His warped agent. 
wield only paranatural abilities similar to drifters. They're able to telekinetically shield themselves with nearby material and launch objects at their target. These entities are particularly destructive and difficult to kill, possibly indicating a greater internal reinforcement of Hiss resonance. Why do certain Hiss display paranatural abilities while others rely on Bureau firearms? Do certain corrupted entities have less potential than the hosts that become Hiss warped? Or is this perhaps an indication of evolution or ma ma maturation? 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 Where's the emphasis on that word? I'm not actually sure. Of the Hiss corruption. Are there other stages of evolution yet to be found? What if the Hiss inhabits a host for a month? A year? Do hosts expire after a certain amount of time? Does the corruption become too strong for an organic body to endure? Only time and well-documented observation will tell. <laughs> Neato. Now let's do this thing. Very nice indeed. Okay, we've got a few things to look at. Let's have a look in here first. The simplest thing to do. Threshold Kid's Proposal. With the recent arrival of the something, there are certain glaring gaps in the Bureau's ability to educate and raise a young kid. Maybe. I don't know. There are no other something for kids to play with, and he is... Maybe it's a specific kid, and he is expected to learn about a frightening new... About a frightening new concepts. If it's plural, then it should be just learn about without the A. Solution. He will require a slow, kid-friendly introduction to paranatural topics. With this in mind, allow me to introduce The Threshold Kids, a television show in which a cast of cheerful puppets explain the dangers of living at the Bureau, but also show the fun side of the paranatural. <laughs> Budget would be minimal. I took a few puppet-making courses at my local community centre. We can have the research staff build the sets, record the footage, and even do the voices. It would be good for morale, and I guarantee he will respond positively to these videos. We can't expect a child to enjoy lectures and pup people in lab coats, but as television has proven for years, kids love puppets. <laughs> interesting, interesting. I wonder if we're going to get to watch any more of those videos. <laughs> that one was so weird that we saw. <laughs> Super duper ultra weird. Right, so has this door cleared up? Or is this still blocked? No, that's cleared up as well. Synchronicity lab. Where are we supposed to go? We're supposed to go to the very end. So let's have a look in the synchronicity lab then. God, I love the way the screen names come up. So good. So good. Having fun in there? Oh. <laughs> Hi. Could just walk straight in. Nice to meet ya. Okay, there's an upstairs as well. Let's just have... Let's fully explore the base bit first. Oh my god, there's even more. Oh, level six. Altered item inside. Access restricted to research personnel. Oh. Well, we need to remember this then. We haven't even got clearance level five yet, let alone six. But when we do... I don't know why we don't have clearance level. We are the director. Surely we should just be given automatically all of them. But sure. This is where we need to come back. Synchronicity lab. Remember that, folks, to remind me when I inevitably forget it. <laughs> okay, no, nothing. Nothing to read down here, apparently. All right, then. Up we go. Let's have a look. There's got to be something. Surely, unless the main reason for this place is just there's an ability to get to here later on. Ah, no, I see. I see a book. Thank you, God. Synchronicity Experiment. At, as a test, television sets were placed in a variety of locations around the world inside rooms identically decorated. The hypothesis was that by identically altering the decor of every room, and then changing the channel in every room but one, that the single differing television would spontaneously align the incoming frequency to match its synchronised counterparts. Hmm. Weird experiment. 
The experiment seemed like a failure until it was observed that the agents responsible for arranging and monitoring these rooms were all experiencing the same emotional turmoil as one clinically depressed member of the team, himself being located in the eastern part of something, something. Uh, psychological examination of the agents proved the correlation. Interestingly, the phenomenon of synchronicity did occur, but not in the way we predicted. So I bet that whatever altered item is down there, the power it will give us is the ability to like link two enemies together and then the damage you deal to one is also dealt to the other. That would be my guess. Or perhaps you link someone with yourself and if you take damage, they take damage. And upgrades for it could be you're able to link multiple people instead of just two together. You're able to link three and then four and then five perhaps. That's going to be my guess for that. Sounds cool. I look forward to getting it. Wait, did we check these? Nothing there. And nothing there. Good, good thing we checked. Very good. Right. There wasn't anything back up this way to look at, was there? Pretty sure that was just the way we came in and that... Yeah. Yeah, nothing up there. Okay. So... Then we have the top left, and aside from that, it's just forward march up there. Ritual office. Wait, this isn't where we're supposed to go, is... Oh, hang on. It might be. I'm looking at that map. Is that saying this lift is where we want to go, or is it saying that going... Uh, forward over here is going to take us round and into where we want to go that way. I am not sure. It could be either of them, honestly. Mission updated. Continue on towards Darling's lab. Okay, that implies that that is the correct way. In which case, we will do the lift. Hmm. Carla, file received. Thank you for the file. It was very helpful. I've re-archived it with the Black Rock research in case you need to refer to them again. Yes, the video shoots are always interesting. I expect my availability for those to decrease in the future. However, oh, pardon me, as my analysis of the newly discovered Black Rock variant is reaching a critical point. I hope you will be able to attend them still. Darling seems to be under a lot of pressure lately, and I'm sure he'd appreciate any support you can provide. Regarding the analysis you provided, I do not have any questions. Thank you for the expeditious delivery. Regards, Carla Vaughan. So she was one of the people in the... in Darling's videos, and she's like... Nah, dude. <laughs> Don't want to be doing this anymore. Is the vibe I'm getting from that. Mm. Any notes we can make out? Not really. Research and records rituals. Obsessive compulsive disorder, hoarding, and anxiety disorders. While certain manifestations of these conditions are simply the result of mental illness, sometimes the individuals are simply performing something called rituals. The something of rituals can vary. Numerology, dream logic, forfeiture, verbal formulae, repetitive action, and casual tethering are just some of the procedures involved. Some rituals are consistent, such as pulling a light switch cord three times to enter the motel, but some are erratic. While most people engage in minor rituals every day, the vast majority do not understand the importance behind their actions. Avoiding disaster, amassing luck, or simply locating lost keys are all results of daily rituals. Individuals who recognise a deeper meaning behind these compulsive actions are inherently aware of the paranatural world, and when located, should be considered for employment at the Bureau. Huh. Interesting. Damn. Sorry, bruh. Cool. I think that's everything up in this section then. Just a couple of bits of lore, but that was good. That's what we want.
So let us return. I wonder, if it, is it faster to just sprint somewhere or dash somewhere? Probably dash a little bit faster. But we got to keep slowing ourselves down every anyway to check for all the all the lore. So it's to my left. Yeah. Okay. That's where we want to be going. Altered item number fifty-two. Altered item number fifty-two AE analysis session two. I will begin by introducing various stimuli to the item. First, a low voltage electric shock. No response. Next, I will introduce heat via a standard Bunsen burner. Ah, oh, the good old Bunsens. A staple of chemistry lessons. No response. Next, a series of solutions will be applied each with a different value on the pH scale from 0 to 14. Sliding your hand to the yellow flame. If you do it quickly, you don't even feel it. Drip, drop, drip, drop, drip, 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 drop, drip, drop, drip. Is the... Response to any value. Wow, you did 14 values Next, in about five I seconds. attempt to communicate. Can you understand me? <laughs> Can you understand <laughs> my words? No. Quack. If you can understand my words. Is this the rubber duck? Are they testing no, the rubber duck? This concludes session two. We'll need time to prepare further tests. <laughs> is that the rubber duck they were testing? Oh my god, it actually is. Oh, that is hilarious. That is amazing. Can we get in there? I want the rubber duck. I really, really want the rubber duck. I think it would prove valuable to my research. Okay. Which means you got to let me have it. <laughs> I'm the fucking director here, okay? Do as I tell you. This way to the lab? Indeedy okay. doody. You must like these HRAs. Sounds like Darling built them. And most of the things around here. Yeah. If Marshall can't help us with Dylan... He's our next best bet. He is definitely one smart Assuming dude. he's not dead. Well, not yeah. Taken over there is that. By the hiss. I'm going to assume he's not, because he sounds too important. Are we going through there? No, we're not. Which means that I want to go through there. Where is the way forward, however? That way into the right. Okay. Hello. Hello. Trying to hide from me. Shatter projectile choke. Is there anything else in here? Any other purpose to this room? Not that I'm seeing. Oh. Never mind. Can't get through there. Hmm. I guess a one it's a one way return. Curios, curios. We shall look out for the point where that gets used then. You can't hide from me. No. Ah, uh, wait. How do we get through here? Ah. Okay, so we go. Like that, we go like that, and like that. HRA lab. Here. Any idea how to make it work? Activate the HRA machine by pressing that button there. Let us have a look, look, see around before doing so. Of course. Who knows what pushing buttons will activate in this place. Configurations. I kind of I kind of doubt that they'd ever make stuff like lock you out if you don't do it right first try, but still, I do want to just make sure we've 
checked everywhere for stuff like this. The Black Rock Prism. Black Rock Prisms are unique formations of black rock, distinct in both their shape and potency. While the density of black rock dampens paranatural forces, the unique something structure of prisms retain frequencies in the range something to something hertz with perfect something harmonization. This report analyzes the results of focusing a something through a harmonized prism onto a something. Methods for the imprinting of non-physical fields onto something, imbuing them with the properties of the harmonized resident something in the prism, will be explored and explained. Good luck with that. Uh, last but not least, can we... No. Okay. Well, here goes nothing. Oh, there's the black rock. Hello again, Director. It appears we have a new problem. We need to get the HRA machine working. I've replaced a couple of spark plugs, but this looks a bit more complicated. Oh, good. <laughs> Darling must have had a system. Randomness isn't in his nature. Restart. Oh, the symbols, the terminals. How do they connect? I'll see what I can do. Restart the punch card terminals and then activate the HRA machine. Okay, well, I'm guessing follow the numbers. <laughs> What's this? Uh... How do I know what I just picked up? <laughs> God damn it. Does this one have a number on it? Five. I'm guessing these will be helpful somehow. So let's run around and find them all. So you need to find all the punch Four up here. Where am I missing one? Ah, there we go. That's got to be all of them, right? I do believe. Okay, well, here's number one. Ah. <laughs> okay, we need to figure this out then. Okay, so one is going to be triple triangle with the right side black. Which is that one. That's correct. Four. Uh, looks like he's saying four should go in five spot. Which is left side black. Uh, which one's number five? Was this one number five? Yeah. Oh, wait. There is no left side black. Unless you count that one, and maybe it's upside down. Each punch card should correspond to a terminal. Yeah. And over here, uh, we have black in the middle is two, single black is three. Uh... Where is three? Single black is three. Black in the middle is two. Where's the second one? Yeah. Which means that upstairs has to be the only one remaining. These whiteboard drawings may be important. Thank you. Couldn't have figured that one out myself. Wait, is that... Does that correlate with what we've actually got left? Yeah, it does. Good. Restart the punch card terminals and then activate the HRA machine. Push da button. Neat. Was that supposed to happen? The prism shattered. Darling's prototypes have a lot of issues. Shit. <laughs> Executive hiss nodes. Communications department. 
Is that anywhere near where I am? No. Why would I go there then? <laughs> Stop it, game. We need more black rock prisms to make this machine work. Darling has another lab, down in the black rock processing site and maintenance. That must be where he keeps the prisms. I've been to maintenance already. I can find my way. But how long will that take? Nothing here is simple. I need to ask her now, before I go. I need something from you first. What do you know about Dylan Faden? I knew this was coming. Lives are at stake here, and we need this machine working to save those lives. Once that is done, Director Faden, then we can talk. I'm the fucking director. We'll talk when She's I say. Right. We talk. As much as I don't want to admit it, I'm the only one who can help. Fine. Which puts you I in an amazing right. bargaining position. Dylan will have to wait just a little longer. But don't call me Director. Jesse is fine. I'll call you Faden. Here, you'll need this key card. Level five? Thanks. Emerald oh, Pope I thought I already had level four. Executive. Once I have the prism, I'll meet you there. Right. I'll move out immediately. And keep an eye out for Darling. Finding him might be the key to stopping the hiss. Well, it's just one large scale HRA. It's there now. We are about to be exposed to a different kind of resonance. Hostile, viral, invasive resonance. I think that's, that's what the Hedron resonance amplifiers are for. Taking the protection Hedron can provide us and keeping us from being wiped out. Zachariah was watching that. Uh, is that space? <laughs> 